Hi there, I'm working in module one. We're doing on your own 1.15 and 1.16, which can be found on page 31. 1.15 says the density of silver is 10.5 grams per cubic centimeter. If a jeweler makes a silver bracelet out of 0.081 kilograms of silver, what is the bracelet's volume in milliliters? Well, the first thing I'm going to note is the density is equal to mass over volume. Okay, and what do we know? We know the density, we know the uh, mass, but we don't know the volume. All right, so let's think about a couple things. We're given the density 10.5 grams per cubic centimeter. Cubic centimeter is the same as milliliter, and so I'm going to do that translation right now because we're going to be given, uh, we're going to be asked to give the answer milliliters. So why not just translate it right into uh, milliliters? Because milliliters and cubic centimeters are exactly equivalent. So that's the same. 10.5 grams per cubic centimeter is the same as 10.5 grams per milliliter. Now we know that the mass is zero point. 0.81 kilograms. But if we look at our units of density, that's given in terms of grams. So what do we need to do? We'll need to convert our kilograms into grams. So kilograms is the same as 1,000 grams per kilogram, or kilograms will cancel, one, two, three. So we end up with 81 grams. Okay. Now, what I don't know is the volume. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to rearrange my equation here algebraically and then put the numbers in correctly. So what I want to say from multiply, I'm going to say density times volume equals mass. I'm going to say volume equals mass divided by density. Okay, so the volume will be 81 uh, grams divided by 10.5 grams per milliliter. Now, <clears throat> looking at this, say, well, those are weird units, but you have to remember when you're dividing, you're really multiplying by the reciprocal. So that's the same as saying 81 grams times uh, one over 10.5 milliliters per gram, okay? You can just remember that these will cancel, or you can write it out like this to say, what is going on here, really? So I'm going to divide 81 by 10.5. As you can see, it's going to be somewhere around 8. So let's use our calculator. 81 divided by 10.5. Did I say 8? No. Doesn't make sense. I'm going to do that again. 80. Clear. Clear. Calculator, 81 divided by 10.5. There we go, that looks more better. 7.7142. Okay, so here's where our significant digits are going to start coming into play here, okay? So this has two significant digits, this has three. Our answer should have no more than two significant digits. So we're going to say 7.7 .7 milliliters. Okay, right. you can see that, yes. Should be able to see that. So the uh, volume of the gold is 7.7 .7 milliliters. Okay. And if that doesn't make any sense, please give me a call and we can discuss it or, you know, send me an email or what have you. Now we're looking at 1.16 on the same page. It's the last on your own in the module. So here we're asked, a gold miner tries to sell some gold that he found in a nearby river person who is thinking about purchasing the gold measures the mass and volume of a nugget. The mass is 
0.319 kilograms and the volume is 0.065 liters. Is the nugget really made out of gold? Okay, so we're told that to remember that the density of gold is 19.3 grams per milliliter. Okay, so if that's the case and we have a mass of 0 0.319 kilograms and a volume of 0 0.065 liters. Well, the kilograms, let's see what that will be in grams. That's going to be, I'm not writing it out at this point to be able to figure out grams to kilograms just by moving the decimal point. So I'm going to say that's 319 grams and the liters to milliliters. I'm going to do the same thing. Okay. Divided by 65 milliliters. So it's going to be somewhere around five, as you can see, which is not going to be the same density. So this person does not have gold. This has fool's gold or something. Okay, we don't actually have to figure out this answer. We just have to be able to tell you, is it gold or is it not gold? The answer is no. Okay? This nugget is not made out of gold. That's all you have to be able to tell me. You don't have to tell me this, but you can in somewhere around 4.9 and something or other. <clears throat> so, I hope you enjoyed these videos, and I will have more as the year goes by.